information through our search writer network. So we have an end-to-end -end layer two tunnel here, otherwise known as the um, you know metro tag. So I hope you guys have um, enjoyed this video. Again, let me just show you what we did on our uh, switches here, our service provider switches, uh, switch two and three. Again, we have you know our trunk uh, between switch two and three, and we also had to go and modify the system MTU size and switch two to switch three to fifteen zero four. And then we went under the switch ports that's connected to. Um, actually, then we had to create a VLAN, VLAN 14, to put our customer into. And then we went under the interfaces connecting to uh, our customer, switch 1 and switch 4, and we put them into uh, the same VLAN. And then we also use the switch port mode dat one q tunnel command along with the l2 protocol tunnel cdp command so again this is the proper implementation of 802.1q tunnel from end to end from switch one to switch four and as you can see here switch one and switch four basically do not see the um, service providers uh, switches at all so it's kind of just like you know a layer three VPN, where you know if you if you look end to end there you don't see any of the you know service providers nodes at all in a layer three VPN. Uh, same same kind of uh, implementation here going on uh, between switch one and four. You we only see each other when we do look at the layer two information. In this instance, we're just doing CDP Cisco Discovery Protocol. So. I uh, hope you guys have enjoyed this video, and I uh, hope you'll be with me with the next one. Thanks. Bye.